Hello everyone. In today's video, we are going to show you how we can sync the data between HubSpot and SAP Business One. The motto of today's video is basically to show you how we can sync the company and the contact information from HubSpot to SAP Business One as well as from SAP Business One to HubSpot. So basically, today we are going to show you how Apsi Connect is capable of doing the bidirectional integration. So the process flow or the integration point which is showing right at your end, it is responsible to sync the information from HubSpot to SAP Business One. In opposite to that, we have another process flow that will sync the contact and the customer information from SAP Business One to HubSpot direction as well. Now we will start off with the synchronization of customer and the contact person sync from HubSpot to SAP Business One. To begin with that, we will first head towards our HubSpot direction or the HubSpot application. So in this HubSpot application, first of all, under the company segment, we will create a new company by providing the basic information whichever is required. So here, first of all, we will give the company domain name. After that, I will provide a company name. Then I will give the other information as well. Here I am giving the city, state and the postal code. Then I will create this particular company. Once the company has been created, then after that, so here I will be giving the phone number. Once I have given the phone number here, after that I will assign or create a new contact person and assign under this particular company. To do that, I will click on the add option in contact and I will create a new contact person. And I will give all the basic informations in order to create a new contact. Once I have given the basic informations like the first name, last name and the email address, then here I will give the basic phone number whichever is required. So these are the basic informations which has to be there and let me create that. Once I have created, then this contact person has been automatically assigned to this particular company. Now, as per the automatic synchronization mode of the AppSy Connect process flows, this data will sync from HubSpot to SAP Business One. And within a few seconds, this data will get populated into our SAP Business One platform. Now we will head towards uh, into the SAP Business One direction. So this is our SAP Business One platform. And now under the business partners, I will go to the business partners master data section. And here I will search by the exact customers or the company name uh, through which we have created the company in HubSpot. So let's search by the name. And as you can see, this is the exact company that we have created in HubSpot and it has successfully synced into our SAP Business One. We will check all the other information like this is the uh, phone number and this is the website details. And if I just go to the contact person information. So here we can see the contact person information whichever we have provided. And after that, if I just go to the address section, we can be able to see 
the address information like the city zip code country and the state information that were provided there while creating the hubspot company has been successfully showing up over here also this is our udf section or the user defined field section where we are uh, storing some extra informations like the web customer id or this is the exact company id which is coming from the hubspot direction and we are storing it under the web customer id segment also if uh, once the customer is or the company is getting synced the sync flag will turn into true so as you can see we have successfully synced the company and the contact person from hubspot to sap business one so in the next step what i'm going to do is i will be creating a new business partner over here or an customer and under that i will assign a contact person and that information will get synced from acp business one to hubspot direction so for that i will create a new business partner so here i will give all the basic informations which are is required So here I've given a code or the business partner code and then I will give the name of the particular company or the account Then I will give the other information like the phone number Then I will give the website information and after that i will head towards into the contact person information here i will give the contact person id so here i will define the name of the contact person then i will give other informations like first name and then the last name After that I will give other informations like telephone number and the email address. So after that I will go to the address section under that I will define some billing or the default address for this particular customer. So here I am giving the address ID as per the company's name then i will give the other informations like city then the zip code state and the country is already preselected now these are the basic informations that has to be given one while creating this particular business partner So as you can see we have given all the information regarding uh business partners and the contact person information then let me just add this once added this information will get synced through apsi connects automatic trigger and it will sync this information from acp business one to hubspot direction shortly now we will go back to the hubspot uh, platform and there we will search or we will see whether the newly created company and the contact person in sap business one has been successfully synchronized into hubspot or not so so let me go to the company tab once again and yeah here you can see that uh, this is the exact company or the business partner that we have created in sap business 1 let me just open it once we have opened we'll be able to see what are the exact informations that it has sent from sap to hubspot like this is the company name this is the website or the domain name this is the phone number 
and here is the other information like the city, state, postal code, etc. Now, in the right hand side of this page, we can also be able to see that the contact person that has been associated with this particular company has also been seen from uh, ACP Business One to HubSpot. So here are the every information or the basic information that we have provided while creating this contact person. So yeah, we can see this is the name, this is the uh, email address for that particular contact person and this is the phone number and we can also see that this particular contact person has been assigned with this particular company. So yeah, this is how we can see the basic informations regarding the company and the contact persons from HubSpot to SAP Business One as well as from SAP Business One to HubSpot. So AppC Connect is a powerful software to do the bidirectional synchronization. So this integration is made easy with AppC Connect's modern iPaaS platform. To know more about the integrations, please log on to www.appseconnect.com. Thank you.